Dusty. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, Dusty. <laughs> Bruce just smoked a big one. Wow, this is <laughs> big. The choice begins now. No matter the weapon, no matter the season, the choice is simple. Just hunt. Featuring North America's favorite hunting couple, Ralph and Vicky. And the posse. You know, Vic, I mean, we just put new windows in it. No. A little bit more shingles. Now, welcome I... to this week's choice. This week, good we are not moving to that house, and we are going to have a 10-point show. We're pointing it out. Yes, we, we are. are. We're 10-pointing it right out. We've got all kinds all of bucks. All kinds of bucks. All kinds of bucks this week. And this week's lucky logo is Scentlock, which Ralph That's really valid. needs on his bottom end because he really stinks. Scentlock first... Vino. <laughs> and at the end of the show, we'll tell you what you do when you find that Scentlock logo. First hunt, yes. we are actually heading to Ohio. Yes, for Dusty. Dusty. You go, girl! Woo! Yeah, whatever. <laughs> okay, and I'll tell you what, it's an incredible hunt. It Snow is, is coming down. The most and, beautiful buck footage and, I have seen in a long time. Oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, okay, oh. you don't actually get to see Tony, but just watch this footage and oh. listen to the audio. Unbelievable. Please, let's just roll the footage. Good dust. <laughs> That's a dead deer. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, Dusty. Oh my god, Dusty. Oh my god, Dusty. 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 I just killed a monster. Dusty. Shh. Listen, listen. Oh. Dusty. Dusty. Shh. Dusty. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, Dusty. Dusty. He's big. Dusty. He's big. Dusty, oh my god. Oh my god, I'm gonna have a freaking heart attack. He's big. Oh my god. He's big. He's he's really big. Oh my god. I just I'm a monster. Oh my god, Dusty. Oh my Shh. god. Oh my god. Shh. Oh my god. That's world class. It's world class. Shh. World class. I'm gonna go find my arrow. Make sure the shot was good. But Come on. He, oh. That looks really good. Oh my god. My Spitfire sure did its job. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> He's mine. I shot a monster. Look how long these G2s and 3s are. Look at that. I'd like to thank the landowner very much for allowing us to hunt his property. We were very fortunate this morning. I'd also like to thank Ralph and Vicki for giving us the opportunity. I did it. I shot a monster white tail here in Ohio. Hey, Dusty, congratulations. Congratulations. You go, girl. That was the most beautiful fuck in the foot. Oh, it was We are right now on a redneck trampoline. OK, stop. Take the fence, bend it over, stop. and you've got okay. it covered. When we come back, we're going to see Waz's sister, Jill, go after her very first buck ever. Stop. With her 10 points. Anything you could do, I could do better. Get off the fence, you're not that tall. Welcome back to the choice. Now we're gonna join Waz, David Wozniak, and his Wozniak. sister Jill with as they the... go out with their 10-point crossbow on her, fir on her first yes. buck, her very first buck. It's the man cool. with the turkey necklace. Let's just keep tormenting about that turkey, turkey necklace, necklace, shall we? <laughs> Gobble this, Waz. <laughs> That's where we're at. I shot a nice 10-point buck standing right here last night. It was about 7.15 and legal shooting time in Ohio ended at 7.33. Based on the sign left on the arrow, and we were also able to review the footage, we decided it would be best to back out, return in the morning, and hopefully pick up his trail. So that's where we're at, and we're about to head out, and hopefully we can find him. It almost looks like he fell down. He slid down. Look at this. Oh. Let's see. 11. Beautiful 11 point. Saw this one come in last night, and there was another big one right behind him, but I had my eye on this guy, and I thought I got a pretty good shot. He went maybe a little over 100 yards, maybe. So, oh. Congratulations, Jill. You go, girl! Now let's join Jared as he goes for his first buck with his 10-point crossbow, and he better be glad his dad's a taxidermist. It's October 2nd. Uh, Jared and I is going to head out to our ground blind here, see if we can uh, stick an arrow in a nice buck this evening. Just a tad back. Um, he was quartering away from us, so 
He went over the edge of the woods over here and uh, he bedded down by a big mall floor rose bush. So we're gonna hang tight here until dark and uh, we're gonna sneak out of here and we're gonna give this buck a couple hours and we're gonna come back and uh, we're gonna recover him. It's uh, a good shot, a good buck, so we're excited. Jerry, <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, hold his head up there. Get a good shot of his head. First bow kill buck. All right. Yay! Good job. You're gonna. I want you to mount him. Who are we gonna get to mount him? You. Oh. Can you just do a full body mount on him? A full body mount. Yeah. Holy mackerel. I like a full body mount jumping, you know. Yeah. Sleeping. Yeah. You're gonna have to skin some deer to get all that. That costs a lot of money. I mean, um, just do walk in with his grunt with his mouth open. Congratulations, Jared and Jill, on your first bucks with your 10 point. Now, when we come back, Bruce is going to try his luck with his 10 point down in Ohio. Welcome back to The Choice. We're going to join Posse Bruce down yep. in Ohio with Todd Frank and Clear Creek Outfitters again because we get some great results down there. Absolutely. And he's bringing up his 10 point. It's early light and... I told you it was the day, it was the day. <laughs> Dude, he's a monster. Is he a big one? Oh, yeah. I knew he was a shooter. As soon as I seen him, I was like, oh. It looked like a good head, didn't it? shooting light. We're down here in Southern Ohio at Clear Creek Outfitters. <laughs> Tyler's shaking as fast as I am. Yeah. <laughs> it's worse in this position than it is there. We're gonna let him sit a second. We're gonna sit down before we fall out of the stand. Thunderhead did his job. I think he's spraying a leak. I think I see. Just another typical Clear Creek monster. Wow, it's the 20th of October down here, just pretty right. They're just starting to get up on their feet in a little bit. And actually, we haven't had the winds. We wanted to come in here several times, but we haven't had the wind right. We had an east wind, so we figured we'd sneak in here and try it. First time. Gorgeous buck. Really nice, a lot of character. Split G3, split brow. Here's a split three, started on that side. Todd, Troy, sure appreciate it. Now we gotta get him out of here. Congratulations, I was, Bruce. I How think, cool I, is that? I think his camera guy was getting as excited I think as he, Bruce was. And that's what it's all about, it sharing is. with each other. It is, absolutely. Hey, Todd, thanks again for well performing for all of our Clear guys. Clear Creek Outfitters. Yep. Absolutely. And now we're going to go and join Bucky On out in Wyoming. a really cool hunt. Yeah. Spotting and stalking Stalkin antelope with his 10 point. Goats. Prairie goats with a 10 point. How cool Check is this that? One. When you come back, we'll show you. Yeah. Yeah. Don't go. No, don't go. We'll be right. Right. Back. 
Welcome back to The Choice. Now, yeah, now let's join Bucky. Let's join Bucky. Crawling through the western countryside, looking for a prairie goat, otherly known as pronghorn. Hey, guess hmm. who I am? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh, oh trophy my gosh. class. Oh, oh my gosh, it's oh world class, oh, oh my gosh. Go ahead, Bucky, it's your turn. Oh, Dusty, oh, Dusty, oh, Dusty, oh my God. It's such a, oh, it's world class. I'm sure we're getting on top of these ridges. We're just sneaking over, seeing if we can't catch them bedded on these hillsides. Oh, 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 oh. I need to get the brush pile. You've got all the time in the world here. Unless they do something else. <laughs> We had that herd that we had at 15 yards from us, couldn't get a shot. They went ahead and spooked. We just spotted a couple more goats, just, just two ridges over here. So we're gonna slip in there and see if it ain't the same herd because it's definitely a good shooter buck. So we're gonna back on the back side of this ridge where they can't see us, circle around, wind's in our face again, give her a shot. Did I tag him? We did it. <laughs> Was that exciting or what? Mm. what? Ten point, baby. The does came at, up above him, and he was down here bedded down. They came up and they came within, I don't know, 20 yards. And there, I think there were seven or eight of them just served or left at 20 yards, and they spooked. Thankfully, they didn't head back down the hill. They headed that way. And he's like, what's going on here? So he just slips right up here. Perfect 40 yard shot, which is no problem with the 10 point. <laughs> oh, spot and stock, dude, is that cool? That's cool. <laughs> is that cool or what? He curls in good, Look at the curl on him. That buck is bad. That is a nice buck. Ivory tipped, good mass on him. It's probably a good 70, 72 inch goat probably. Up here spot and stock in Wyoming, northeast Wyoming with a 10-point crossbow. And it doesn't get any better than that. Wow, what a show. And you know, again, you're, it's, it's your choice to make. That's right. I mean, it doesn't matter whether, you, whatever kind of weapon you want, the season's open, doesn't matter. Take advantage just, of it. And putting a crossbow in your hand is just another dimension of hunting. It's so cool to do. I mean, just let's do it. Let's have fun. Let's keep, keep getting the kids, getting the, the adults, getting everybody out there. Hmm. Okay. Keep going. You're doing good. This week's lucky logo was scent lock. If you happen to see it, you need to log on to choicetv.com. Wow, you're getting good at it. Yep. Fill out some information. Someone's going to great win some great scent lock stuff. And if you win it, please send it to Ralph because he stinks and he needs it. She's scent free. She needs to be. Whatever. We want to thank you again for making your choice. The choice. We'll see you see next, next week. week.